I get so caught up in the middle Thinking of drowning in those blue eyes I'm losing sight cause I am falling I'm so deep down, deep down And it's not a lie That I die I can't hide Kempinski Seychelles Resort Bay Lazar is one of the most luxurious resorts in Seychelles and in today's video I'm going to give you a tour of the resort as I stayed there during my most recent visit to Seychelles. So this is the reception or lobby area and it's like your first point of contact when you get to the resort. The resort is quite a huge one so there are buggies around to take you from one point of the resort to the other if you don't want to do a lot of walking. So this is the lobby area, there's also an information desk over here, there's also um, a car rental desk um, at the corner and there's this nice um, waiting area when you get in and they are now about to check you in so let me show you guys that real quick so this is the waiting lounge and trust me you would really appreciate this lounge if you get to the resort like after midnight because you get to like really chill get comfy and all of that whilst they are actually you know preparing your room and it's quite a, like a huge space literally has everything so there's a pool table where you can you know get yourself involved with you know playing pool if you are bored and it has a lot of chairs sofas everywhere and this is such a cool place so comfortable and you don't really have to you know stress yourself all you need to do is relax whilst they prepare your room there's also a workstation with um a computer as well as a printer so in case you need to get some work done in case you need to print out stuff and all of that you can do that real quick over here and all in all like this really came in very good for us because we arrived at the resort um i think at 2 a.m it was at dawn and so like really it was like we were tired and so this came in really comfy for us we just had to chill over here whilst they prepared our room There's also a washroom located in the waiting lounge. So there's one for females and there's one for males, obviously. And so if you'd want to like shower, freshen up as you wait whilst they prepare your room, you can do that over here. So it has a shower, it has, you know, um, shower gel, towels, lockers, everything. And so you can literally freshen up over here whilst they prepare your room and yeah, just to get more comfy especially if you've had like a really long flight and you're feeling a bit uncomfortable so you want to shower and all of that you can do that over here the waiting lounge also has restrooms so one for males and one for females and i love the whole um color theme or color thingy going on here the sinks the mirror like everything is so on point and so this is for you to like freshen up as well so there are a lot of face towels for you to you know freshen up and i love the fact that they care about the comfort of their their guest um, when they arrive at the resort so just for you to feel at home whilst they prepare your room so that is it for the waiting lounge now let's go explore some other parts of the resort This is a bar and lounge just outside of the waiting lounge and also just at the reception and lobby area. So the resort actually has four different restaurants slash lounges on the premises and this is one of them. So this is the Plantes Lounge and Bar located just at the, at the reception or lobby area. 
now as you descend from the lobby there are two other restaurants which are right opposite each other there's lindocini restaurant which is a chinese restaurant and cafe lazar where complimentary breakfast is served so cafe lazar is where breakfast is served and it's breakfast with such a lovely view So this is the fourth restaurant at the hotel. It's called Winsong Beach Restaurant and it's just around the pool and beach area. We actually had food and drinks from here on our first day and the food was good. So this is the pool area and it has such a lovely view overlooking the beach as well. The view is just amazing and they also have this water canal thingy to the side. I don't know if it's artificial or natural but it's actually very lovely with these you know very beautiful rock formations like it's such a lovely view and I love it. There's a recreation stand or a recreation desk just at the pool and beach area which gives you all the necessary information about the pool temperature, the sea temperature, the sea tides, when the tides are high, when the tides are low and all of that. And one amazing thing about this resort is the fact that you have access to complementary recreation activities and so there's like a shadow that shows the different activities that you can partake on different um, times during specific days and this same shadow is actually provided in your rooms as well now to the beach area as you may have already seen this resort is a beachfront resort and so you have access to a very clean private beach which is so amazing so now let's go have a look at the beach So now let's go check out the rooms. Basically, a room at this resort ranges from $550 to $1,500 per night, depending on the type of room and then the view you are going for. So let's go have a quick room tour. So this is the door or the entrance to the room. And there's a walkway over here. And we also have a coffee making machine with glasses as well as uh, bottles of water over here as well. And there's also a mirror with a workstation over here in case you need to get some work done and all of that you can do that over here. And there's this um, long mirror as well for outfit check and there's a wardrobe to the side. So now moving to the bathroom we have um, a sink here with all of these essential stuff we have um, a hygiene set disposable bag shower caps 
face towels um loofah pads and like all of those you know necessary stuff and of course a mirror so we have the toilet we have the shower we have ropes and we have towels and it's actually a very spacious um bathroom So now let's have a look at the room itself. Um, obviously you have your bed over here and at the bedside there's this um, alarm clock which has multiple charging points. So you have um, this wireless charging point over here and it has two, it has a socket, it has two, um, what is it called, USB ports. It also has two cables one for android and one for iphone and this is amazing like and you also have a lounge or a sitting area in the room as well it's like a, a mini sitting area and i love it and i also love the whole um stone wall thingy going on over there it's it's so unique it's different and it's very nice so now let's move outside to see what our view looks like so this room is a hill view slash garden view room and so you have like a garden view and you also have a view of the water canal with the rocks and so you have this like you know private sitting area outside to yourself and you can just you know chill out here with your partner with your husband with your boyfriend whoever you came on holiday with and it's like you know just have a chill time to yourself So this is the car park at the resort and so if you rent a car as a tourist you don't need to worry about the safety of your car because there's a very secured um, car park area at the hotel and also if you rent an electric car like we did you don't need to worry about how you're going to charge your car because there are a lot of charging points at the hotel's car park where you can actually charge your car for free and so you don't need to worry about that so the distance between the main gate to the property itself is quite a distance so i'm going to be showing you guys the distance between like the two as we leave the resort so this is us leaving the resort so you're going to see the distance as we drive from the property itself to the main gate and so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and you enjoyed you know this tour of kempinski seychelles bay lazar and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it don't forget to subscribe if you are not yet subscribed to the channel and if you have any questions you can drop them in the comment section below and i'll do well to respond to them see you guys in my next video and if you are considering visiting seychelles this is obviously one of the most luxurious resorts that you can visit although it's a little bit on the higher side but trust me it's worth the price See you guys in my next video. Bye. I get so caught up in the middle Thinking of drowning in those blue eyes I'm losing sight cause I am falling I'm so deep down, deep down And it's not a lie that I die I can hide
If it gets too dark